My name is Andrew McAllister. I'm the Director of Academic Computing and Innovation at OCAD University, and this is a brief screencast to teach you about Canvas and the new user interface. So I've logged us in here to our Canvas community version, on-premise hosted, exciting version, and here I'm on the recent activity screen. And for comparison purposes, I've also got myself logged into the Canvas version that's hosted by Instructure. So you'll see that there isn't any OCAD U specific branding here as we're working on the upgrade. But you can see here the dashboard looks very familiar. However, this is in the list view. So the major changes here that you'll notice is that a lot of the navigation has moved to the left hand side. So the navigation that you normally saw across the top with courses and groups, grades and calendar, and then my inbox and settings and so on have migrated to the left hand side. So here is my dashboard. Here are the courses. I can look at my list of courses here. So this is analogous to flipping over to our course list here. And I can look at my groups and calendar. Again, those two user interface elements have moved from the top to the left okay and then my inbox has moved from the top right to here so you can view my inbox now some of my settings have moved from the top right under account so here is where i can modify my profile and view my settings. You can see that there's a, a secondary level of navigation here where I can edit a number of items. You'll see that this is repeated in the course view. For a moment, I'm gonna go back to my dashboard. So this is the dashboard list view in the old version of Canvas. And actually the default in the new version of Canvas will look like this, which is an interesting tiled view. It will show you the number of announcements and discussions and maybe perhaps assignments and files that you have that are new. It also gives uh, faculty members the ability to create a nickname for the course and change the color so that you can e easily memorize which one's which. You can also flip back to the old view if you'd like, if you found this list view more intuitive. But let's drill down into a course. I'm gonna use this Welcome to the Laptop Program 2015 course. And I'm gonna drill down to it here in the new version. And this is what it looks like in the new version. So you'll notice that the navigation on the left-hand side is consistent. It, it's just not exactly against the left side. So here we have home, announcements, modules, pages, discussions, and so on. And here it is the same here. You'll see that a lot of the individual page layouts have not changed either. So this is how the modules page appears in the old version. And this is what it looks like in the new version. If I want to look at an individual page, so this is a course that was directly ported over, you'll notice that it's the same on the new version as it is on the old version. So you see that all of my course content was completely maintained when I pulled it over into the new version. So you should have the same experience as well. Same thing for discussions. I can drill down on a discussion and hey, look, all of my page content has been maintained. If you wanna learn more about Canvas, you can go to community.canvaslms.com and learn more about Canvas either through the Canvas guides which are individually segmented by student or instructor or administrator. And each one of these guides has detailed videos and is broken down by section. If you wanna learn more about the new features of Canvas, you can look at the Canvas release notes. Now there's an awful lot of these release notes and we've tried to summarize them in our knowledge base but each set of release notes comes with a handy dandy screencast, which you can watch. If you have any further questions, contact us at ithelp at ocadu.ca. You can reach me via email or on Twitter at andrewmc.ca.